So with the focus shifting to AI, you could make an argument that the U.S. has the lead there still. But on the other hand, I suppose you could argue that AI also needs vast amounts of physical infrastructure, including data centers, energy, chips. Who has the upper hand when it comes to AI? I don't have a super strong view on this, but I could outline a potential scenario that China could be leading on AI based on a few factors. First and most important, as you point out, Tracy, that China has a lot of electrical power. So the U.S. may have all of the computing because it has all of the um, advanced chips from NVIDIA. As Howard Letnick says, China has at best the fourth best chips uh, in terms of AI, and that is a pretty substantial constraint. But what is a bigger U.S. constraint maybe right now going forward is that there just isn't enough electrical power, um, especially if uh, you know Trump is taking wind turbines offline and being very discriminatory about certain types of energy. Um, and China, I think, has organized itself as a civilization to deny nothing towards heavy industry. China may not have a lot of advanced chips, but it has a lot of mature chips, which are going to be necessary for inference. So if we do invent God in a box, you know, we're going to be running queries all the time to figure out how to um, automate and shop and whatever else. And that is going to require a lot of processing power. And I think this is where uh, China's mature chips uh, are going to have a pretty good advantage. And China also has, I think, a, another unique advantage, which is that its training data uh, might be more strategically valuable. Uh, China has hmm. most of the manufacturing capacity uh, in the world. Mm -hmm. And, you know, what does the U.S. have? Well, we have a lot of consulting companies and a lot of healthcare companies. So maybe the U.S. will automate something on the scale of uh, McKinsey. And um, China will automate something on the scale of Foxconn. And, um, <laughs> you know, they're going to have a lot That's more manufacturing production and we're going to have a lot more better consultants. 